y'all. They know they wrong for this. Okay, y'all, how do we feel about this? I just spent too much money. Y'all tried the Sol de Janeiro? What's up, y'all? I've been getting y'all tax refunds. Time. Good morning. Happy Saturday. It's like 7.45, 8 o'clock right now. Oh, I need to get more of this. I tried. It was not at Target yesterday when I went. Target versus Walmart makeup prices is like a two, three dollar difference. I went yesterday to get some black eyeliner. I was the eyeliner like nine dollars. Stop buying. I think I'm about to sit there and spend ten dollars on some eyeliner. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. It is so early. We're about to start the shopping adventure super early, but got my mirror. Oh, is this the magnifying side? Ooh, hi. But I'm about to put on just a little bit of concealer. Oh, also, welcome to another vlog. Yes, I am starting the vlog in my PJs without my hair being done. It is what it is. Today we are going thrifting. We're going to several different thrift stores. We're going to start in Virginia Beach, so we'll probably go to Goodwill, DAV. Who did not put their primer on? Yeah, we're going to Goodwill, DAV. Just oh Lord, I'm gonna do this. Just whatever is out there. We'll probably stop it. Pretty much all of them. Um, that's why we're starting a little early. Early, early. Doing, girl. I like doing makeup on the magnified side of the mirror. That's different. You really get into all the crevices. Mm. This is my little foundation brush, y'all. I got this off of Amazon. I need to invest in better brushes, but brushes is like $30, $40. Mm -mm. That just doesn't make sense to me. Not even on like a cheap tip, but like that just does not make sense to me. I'm so excited to start doing my top eyeliner again. I used to do that every day in college and then i just got away from it i guess when you do something so much you kind of get tired of it this is the eyeliner i bought yesterday i think this is the exact one i used to wear too back in college this is the one <laughs> i want to do a wing on the inner part but i've never done that before and i don't know if today is the day to try why does it look like i don't think that's the result i'm trying to show Oh no. Oh no, Charlie. <laughs> oh my God. Should I do the other eye, y'all, or just take this off? Okay, y'all, so we have two outfit options. I can wear this cream bodysuit with this long sweater that has slits, pretty high slits, all the way up to the arm on both sides. And then these. These are like dressy joggers. So that's one option. Or, which is the option that I'm leaning toward, I can do this long duster with this jumpsuit. Just like a loose, wide leg jumpsuit. And I feel like this is gonna be the most comfortable option. This is cute, but I feel like this is something I would only wanna wear for a few hours. But if I have to be out all day, out and about walking around, I'd probably do this one. Up doing the um stuff on my other eye, just don't pay no attention to it because I feel like I'm back in I don't know Avril Lavigne era with this eyeliner. But anyway, we here at this spot called Thrift Store City, so let's see what they got up in here. Good morning, good morning. Mm. Chris, why are you catching me while I'm <laughs> So y'all, I'm in here today being Janae, my mom's personal shopper. Oh, so they're my looking. Personal shopper. Say that. <laughs> Oh, okay. Let's start with the ladies' blazers. This is cute. This is real thin, too. This would be good for the um, summertime. Hmm. This is so cute, but I cannot fit this. This is like a medium small. Oh, it's so cute. We're looking at the women's suits. Pink. Come through pink. Got the pants. 
love this. It looks blue on camera, but this is a purple. Mm. new $30 you you know you need to stop and it still has the thing on it boom ba boom ba boom ba boom ba boom boom ba boom ba 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 all right y'all round two with it put up at goodwill y'all it's a lot of folk out here it's late late like for real i found some cute stuff at the last place we just came from we are um yeah i found some real cute stuff so i'm gonna have to show y'all when we get back to the cribbo you want to say something to the folk <sighs> okay, we at Goodwill. That's all I had. All you had was a sigh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Be like that sometimes. The color of the week here is orange. I think this this tag is is blue. But nice little shacket action. It's cute. You should try this on my. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I found Janita's blazer. Uh -uh. This from Forever Twenty One. Really cute. <laughs> Y'all, we found another blazer. <laughs> oh yeah, that's cute. I like the paneling yeah, on the thing. Color block. That's cute. That. Y'all, they got some Savage X in here. Yeah. If it was my size, I would get it. Yeah, a little satin slip. She's cute. Okay, y'all, how do we feel about this? You said it's nice. Yeah, that's very nice. Got pockets, oh, cute little buttons, a 14 miss. God, that's Bag, bag. I wish it was long sleeve, low key. If this ain't the cutest little thing I've ever seen. Operation Man on the tie. Marina, what about it like that? Ooh, Tasmanian devil. I found these cute suspenders. I don't know how I'm gonna ever wear these, but. Y'all remember, maybe in like two vlogs back, I got an XOXO board from Target. Y'all. Why did my mama find this humongous XOXO board? All the pieces for $5. The same price that I paid for my little mini one. I'm about to check out, but I'm trying to see if these suspenders, or we're trying to see if these suspenders actually work or not. This is good. It works. That's a nice tight fit right there. I feel like this would be a good accessory in the summer because in the summer you can only wear but so many clothes. Oh, yeah. Make it fit you, then it's no, it's no, it's no point. It looks like it works, but. Oh, there you go. You, you can lengthen it? Before. Let's see if it, if it. If it goes back like that. See how it looks. These are so cute. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, I like these. It's cute. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, we finna go check out. Sometimes it's soft as a misty rain. Magically touches my soul. Y'all, I don't know where we're going after this, but I, I I need to stay in the car because at this point, I just spent too much money, too much money. Ooh, it's raining. I got my camera out. Girl, make better decisions. We had to take a lunch break, huh? Yeah. Right here, size and vegetables. We're at this place called um, Black Eyed Peas. It's in Lynn Haven Mall and it's a black owned. And they heard about it on TikTok or whatever, so we trying it out. Y'all, I found some good stuff. I think I'm all shopped out because I'm tired of swiping my card. That's the only reason why. I swiped it twice. No, I swiped it three times. <laughs> <laughs> we got a hind quarter. Got mac and cheese oh, and cabbage. Yo, Yo, they got close. sugar at the bottom of the tea. Doesn't dissolve. I can't with the sugar, sugar at the bottom. I got a chunk of sugar. And I was like, wait a minute. And then I looked and I said, I hope glop. 
of sugar at the bottom of my sweet tea. Yeah. Y'all, you can barely see it. Yeah, you can't see it at all on camera, but I just tried this. I just tried this Laura Mercier powder. I might, well, I'm not gonna get the mini one today, but I wanted to come in here to try it. I tried the translucent medium deep because I heard that it's real good. So yeah, I might come back and get it later. I'm talking about I'm gonna come back and get it. Yeah, you certainly are, cause girl, they don't got nothing in stock, Joe. Have y'all tried the, um, y'all tried the Sol de Janeiro fragrances? This is 62, I don't really like this one. What's your favorite one, Janae? 40. 40? Oh, that one. You got the last one. Oh, I added that one to, oh, you trying to come back. Oh, I added that one to my cart too on um, Sephora. Did you? Yeah, the 41. But you got the last one. Did I? Yeah, you did. You want this one? No, it's okay. It's okay, thank you. Now I'm in another fitting room. I know y'all probably like, girl, where is you going on? But we're in Old Navy. And I tried on these balloon jeans. They're not really giving me the drama. Y'all see the balloon effect or whatever? I feel like I need to stand up on the thing to see. Yeah, I need it to be a little further back to really get the full effect. I can't tell if I like these or not. I don't care for this little wash right here. Wish that these were lighter, either darker. But this like mid color is throwing me off, I think. I don't know what it's giving. I guess it's not really giving nothing. Y'all, we just live out of Lynn Haven. I didn't get anything. <laughs> Shocking. You want to tell me about your experience at Black Eyed Peas? No, I'm traumatized. <laughs> so if you're ever in the Virginia Beach area around Lynn Haven, <clears throat> And you see a restaurant called Black Ivy's. Three out of ten. Wouldn't I recommend? <laughs> Yo, it wasn't trash. It was just a lot of bad things. But the chicken was really good. Um, and what else? The cornbread was really good. Your portions were uh, disappointing. Yeah, the portions were small. My mom had the carrot souffle. She didn't like that at all. She sent that back. The macaroni and cheese is very um powdery. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And my mom said that happened. Yeah, she said the butter beans were good, but Ma said that happens when they overcook the macaroni. The tea was what? The tea had sugar at the bottom of it. Our server just took a really long time to come give us the food and to come back, and it was just a lot, but. I mean, y'all try it for yourself if you're interested, because, you know, people can have different experiences. Maybe we just had a bad experience. If we come on another day, you know, it might be different, so. Yeah. Yeah, not right now. Boom, 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 boom. Y'all, my face all oily. It is 9 p.m. We've been out for like 12 hours, and this, is the damage. <laughs> Still bring your bags in. Let me show them this. Y'all, I didn't even show y'all. This luggage bag I got at the first thrift store that we were at. You wanna switch bags? Yeah, Janae hating. She wants this bag. <laughs> this is so cute, y'all. It doesn't have the long strap, but I said that's fine anyway, because I most likely just hold it like this. Don't wanna just leave y'all hanging and not show y'all all the stuff we got. So, I don't know, definitely not doing it tonight. Cause your girl is pooped, but maybe tomorrow once I get back to Maryland, we gonna see. But yeah, for now y'all, we finna call it a night. Thank y'all for spending the day with us. And some yeah, see y'all tomorrow. So we all happy Sunday, it is a new day. Thank the Lord for a new day, okay? We are in Richmond right now. I am on my way to meet up with Courtney real quick because I was on my way back to Maryland, but she's in Richmond, so. So yeah, I'm just stopping by for a second because today is her birthday and I got her a little cake. I'm gonna give her the rest of her gift on Wednesday, but for right now, cute little cake with this huge bow. I saw this in Walmart, I was like, oh yeah, we need this for the drama. But yeah, just wanted to hop in, chat with y'all for a second. I'm going to pick y'all back up once I leave from here. Oop. It was so good to see Courtney. I have not seen her since October when we threw my mom and my aunt a surprise birthday party. She came to that, but I have not seen her since then. I pulled up maybe around like 1.20ish and she had to leave around two because she had a makeup appointment. And I said, go off girl, go off. I'm not even mad at you, okay? Anyway, y'all, we're leaving Richmond. Bye Richmond. 
I have two and a half hours left of my drive. So that means I'm about to be watching YouTube videos. But I'm actually watching an old video right now of Karen Britchick, a wardrobe clear out video right now. Cause y'all know in the last video I was saying that I'm trying to clean out my life. You know, just get rid of stuff that I don't use, don't wear. Watching videos like this just helps you to get in the groove of things and get in the mindset of getting rid of stuff. And I love to see what people have in their wardrobes. Cause fashion is just so funny. People just have the cutest stuff. I'm like, I need to step my game up. I haven't shopped with my mom and my sister. I can't even tell you the last time. Being out with them and having fun, it was it was just everything. I've been getting y'all tax refunds, fine. I forgot to tell y'all, this weekend we went to Lynn Haven. We were trying to figure out why was it jam packed in there like it was Black Friday or as if it was like a tax free weekend. And Janae was like, you know what? It's because of tax season. I said, oh, okay, so the folks out here spending their checks. I have not filed my taxes yet and I don't think I'm getting anything back. But Lord willing, I ain't gonna own nothing because I paid y'all already. Did I or did I not pay y'all thousands of dollars this year? Hmm. What's up, y'all? We about to get into these clothes that we brought. I showed y'all mostly everything, but the stuff that I did not show y'all, we're gonna get into it right now. I showed y'all mostly everything, but of the stuff that I did not show y'all, this dark blue denim wash over shirt. I've been looking for one of these, but I really wanted it in a lighter color. Um, but when I saw this, I was just like, this is such nice quality. I can see myself wearing this a lot, so I ended up picking it up anyway. And then I also got this super oversized white linen men's shirt. This is short sleeve and it's from the brand Jose Bank. This is gonna be well worn this summer because I can wear this open or I can also wear it as just a plain white shirt tucked into a skirt or some shorts or anything. So I'm not trying to slip on, I just came from the gym and it's just, you know, I just wanted to show y'all this stuff. This is one of my little prized possessions. This is a navy blue suit, originally from Ross, still had the tags on it. The brand is Rachel Z. So it's really, it's really kind of giving trench coat, but it, it is a blazer. Y'all see it has buttons all the way down the side, and then on the back it has the little belt detail. And it came with the pants. And it came with the pants, y'all. It came with the pants. This suit is about to be so cute. Like, I can wear this to my business meetings. I can wear this to brunch, throw it on with some sneakers, maybe even a little cap. Like, this is... It's about to be so cute and lately when i've been going to the thrift that's been like one of the main things that i've been looking for is suits because suits are so expensive but they're so expensive i got this one for maybe ten dollars i feel like i'm going shopping again for the first time because i forgot i brought all this stuff i got these these are actually military pants but they are so cute y'all they have black paneling down the side they're hunter green these, I believe, are men's. They got the permanent crease in them. And then these are good pants to cuff. These are straight legs. And so the cuff is going to be so cute. These with the cuff, I cannot wait to wear these. And again, those are military pants. These are actually a uniform pants. So don't be afraid to shop in the sections that you might not typically shop in because you never know what you can find. These are another men's pant. And these fit. They fit so good. They have a sewn-in cuff. And then they also have the permanent crease as well Gianfranco Ruffini Italy I cannot wait to wear these these are gonna be so cute in the summertime with just like a little tank and some sandals girl stop I got this black shirt this is kind of giving me waitress vibes just a little bit but when I saw it I was like this is a good elevated basic like it's not just your plain black shirt because it has elongated sleeves and then it also it's like a wrinkly fabric so it's a tad bit see-through just a tad and so all of that combined, I just feel like to me, this is more of an elevated button up. And so that's what I want. I want basics, but not regular basics. And everything I've shown you thus far, including this here is often be thrifty. I totally forgot I grabbed this. This is a long navy blue blazer with red stripes. This was from QVC, it looks like. But I paid $5 for this because it was 50% off. Y'all see it's just, it's just a long line blazer. And honestly, I wasn't gonna get this because of the other long line blue blazer that I showed y'all, the navy blue one that's part of the set, but because this has the red stripes, and it is just a bit of a different build as well. It has the pocket buttons, two buttons, but yeah, it's slightly different, so I figured it would be okay to grab it. And if I can remember correctly, my total from Be Thrifty was like maybe $40 for all of that stuff. And next we have some stuff from Goodwill. And actually this is all the stuff that I already showed y'all. So I'm not going to show y'all this again. This was $10. I was like kind of taken aback by that. It wasn't on sale. This is my prized possession. This is 
so cute when i saw it i was like wow i'm surprised nobody has grabbed this yet i think people just kind of looked right past it but this girl this could be an everyday tote a weekender going to work tote like everything it could just be a statement accessory for your outfit this has so much life to it and i just cannot wait to wear it i really cannot wait we don't know if i showed y'all this this i think i'm gonna take to the cleaners because it has a little stain on it my mom said it might be a protein stain um so i don't know but this is another elevated basic this is a white button up but as y'all can see it's giving so yeah i was really intentional about wanting to pick up elevated basics as well as suit sets super cute fluffy white button up this i don't know if i can wear it in the summer it is pretty porous but i don't know it just seems like it might be a little itchy in the summer so i have a feeling this is definitely going to shrink if i try to wash it so i'll probably take this to the cleaner as well this is that purple pantsuit that i showed y'all did i show y'all this I don't know if i showed y'all this but it's just a purple button up with the pants and the pants are straight legs yeah this is the pink blazer set blazer suit set these are wide legs with the blazer <laughs> oh i don't think i showed y'all this i don't know i keep saying i don't know i don't remember and i don't think whatever this is from fashion nova this is a size 3x and it's just a sleeveless shimmery dress and it's super long this literally goes down to my feet and when i saw it i was like i have to have this it's a 3x like i said but this is supposed to be really tight i think on me it's going to be a little loose but i think it's still going to be very flattering and this is something that you could wear during the day since it has that oversized look it's gonna be a bit more effortless so yeah i could definitely throw this on in the daytime with some sandals I'm just so excited about everything. And then this is the stuff I showed y'all at Goodwill. Y'all saw me try on all of this stuff. So yes, that's all folks. If y'all wanna see more thrifting videos, just let me know. That's all you have to do is let me know and I'll definitely make sure to have my camera on me when I go thrifting. What's going on y'all? I do not know where this vlog left off at, but, but we just came out of Target. Ooh, okay son. Give me back my melanin. Give me back my melatonin. <laughs> Y'all, I found the Ida B. Wells Barbie. Turn right on the right down road. From Target, I found one. And I don't know about y'all, I don't know if y'all were looking or whatever the case, but they are not on Target's website from what I've seen. I saw them on Walmart. I saw some on Target, some on Walmart. I don't know, it's a little sketchy just cause the pricing is weird, da da da. But anyway, I found one of the original Barbies for $35 at Target. And I was like, oh yeah, I have to pick this up. Cause this is like a collector's item. So I'll probably just keep this forever and try to keep it in a really nice pristine condition. And then Courtney actually put me on to these. It's the Finery uh, Perfume, Finery Body Mist from Target. So I got Sweet on the outside. This is a dupe for Billie Eilish perfume. It smells very similar. And then I got Flower Bed. Y'all, the sun is so bright. I got this one flower bed. This one smells like fresh out the shower, just really clean, but it has a nice flowery, almost fruity undertone. So I really like this one. So yeah, that's it. I just wanted to show y'all that, but I'm gonna go ahead and close the vlog out here. Thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'ma catch you on my next one. Peace. Y'all, this is, what the heck? What is that? But um, so let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, looking busted and disgusting. <laughs> What's that, yo? Wait, is this the start of a new vlog? I guess I can add this to the last vlog. Wait, does this not have a cap? Oh, here's the cap. <laughs>